You know when parents have to decide between the children, and it's funny to watch them struggle try to pick which one's the favorite? Well, Air Raid exists. Fuck off! Finally getting to Air Raid, probably the coolest deluxe aerial bot. Why? Because his character arc is fucking YOLO! I really have to apologize for the insensitive joke. I've been a little on edge lately. I just found out I was adopted by my birth parents. I shave between edits, which I find really strange. And YouTube's been demonetizing my videos because it's gay. Air Raid would rather charge into battle more than anything. I'm sure Strong Arm is fucked off triggered. That's not in the rules! No! Air Raid transforms into, wait for it, wait for it. A jet! Fucking gold! However, this jet is beautiful! The black color scheme added with the silver, yellow, and red is such a standout! A deco that should feel dark, but it's got a swift, clean, molded design that stops it from being evanescence level edgy. <laughs> Robot Kibble, care none. Air Raid has adjustable wings that add a little bit of play. As well, you can add the weapons. The universal combiner attachment feels like an oversized brick, but the white gun looks Fucking amazing on the black surface. Something about this works nicely. Maybe it's because it helps contrast with the white underneath. What? Have I seen these weapons before? Okay, did someone say missiles? He's got them. Alright, overall this might be biased, but I love the look of this. But hey, can you go two for two? Robot mode! can express how much I love this thing, so I'm gonna review it using words. Air Raid looks fantastic. Similar to Firefly, his main color changes in modes, this time going from black to white. Odd choice, but okay. I think the idea is that they wanted more of a unified look for the team in robot mode and make the alt modes a little more unique in between by using the colors. The color scheme is nice, and yes, parts are shared with Skydive, but unlike Skydive, the joints seem respectfully fine on Air Raid. They share the same mid-arm section, legs with the exception of the back, tail wings, nose cone, combined port and even the weapons with the double barrel gun and rockets on the universal combiner attachment. The head is beautiful, great molding and design, feeling realistic with a nice silver paint application with the addition of blue and the sexiest unibrow ever. Wait a minute. Did somebody say, ARTICULATION! Ball jointed head, hinge shoulders, ball joint shoulders, rotation below, elbow moves, waist rotation, ball joint hips, rotates below, and a knee. Oh, yes, he's got back kibble. You really think I care at this point? No. Nothing new with the leg, same articulation as the other ones, but the black feels consistent with the foot. Arm mode's okay too. I do like how simple it is to get into. The arms don't do much. Same articulation, hands, double elbow, port, nothing new. Air Raid is the best out of the set. That might just be my opinion only, I don't feel like there's a wrong answer, but I love this guy. He was the only one in Wave 2, so I'm not sure if he had a worse release than the rest of the aerial bots, but if you can get him, do it, you sack of shit! Thanks to Larry Arts Production for sending this out, a good friend and not a poop nose. I really do appreciate it. Get yourself an Air Raid, you deserve to be happy. Fill that void. One thing that just bothers me about this.